three, two, one. Go. So we're Bram Moto. I'm Bear, and this is Gabby. What are we about? Look at this camera. Look at this camera. <laughs> Couples riding motorcycles together. Look at this. I'm from different backgrounds. I'm a pharmacist. And I am a journalist, and I'm from Brazil. And I'm from the United States, but we both love motorcycles. So we thought we would do motorcycle stuff together. Maybe bring you along, see what you enjoy. I'll be mostly back cameras, adjusting to living in the garage with him, learning a little bit more about mechanics. Because this growing up, I was always around mechanics. That was what my uh, father's occupation was. I liked to hang out in the garage. I'd like to bring Gabby along. We've for been that. riding all over New York State, and as we bear this freezing weather, um, it's time to go into the garage, and we're gonna go right back to where it all began. Um, the 1964 Honda Dream, it's been neglected again. You know, you have newer bikes, bikes that perform flawlessly, are fantastic to ride. The older bikes sometimes sit by the wayside. Why did the GoPro just stop recording? <laughs> Pretty no, much. Let's a, do a little it, bit more. It just started again. <laughs> it hears us. Um, do more of an introduction of the. I'm going to start back over again at the. So we're going to start it. Start where it all began. The 1964 dream. It's been neglected again. It's time to do it and do it right this time. Okay. All right. So let's do that. So they're both recording anyway. So. Three. Three. Two. One. All right, uh, we're going to get started on the uh, Honda Dream here today. I want to make a lot of changes on it. We had some issues. This cover fell off. As you can see, it took a lot of road damage. Uh, I don't think I'm going to reuse these covers, though. I'm actually going to try and get a smaller battery maybe mount it inside in the frame here where the air filter assembly used to go just going to put a little pod filter on it to free up that space i want this whole side clean just flat maybe make a number plate to go over the side of it and do the same thing on the other side um, we're going to change out the uh, the rear shocks uh, something a little more modern something maybe adjustable to give us a little bit better ride um, coming up towards the front, we have to put a new clutch in it. And uh, there's a little spinning oil filter set up inside of the engine in here. And that's actually got a chunk broke out of it. So we need to source out one of those and replace that. Um, we're looking to do something with the front end. Um, it's very bulky. She's a big girl on the front end. Um, we're thinking of maybe... Um, I want to see if I can find an, a set of forks and um, I want to see if I can find maybe a fork assembly and the clamps maybe off a maybe a Honda Superhawk maybe I want to try and stay period correct if I can then I can reuse the original tire hub all that kind of assembly try and keep it similar to what it would have been back in the 60s but a little bit different this front setup is very strange. It's a cantilever suspension system, so the whole front end pivots on the front. When they say it rides like a Dream, they've never actually ridden a Dream before. They're actually not very good, so we're going to up, upgrade the front end, maybe a little bit of an update on the front. Um, the engine's going to be pulled out. We're going to totally strip all the wiring and start all over again. Um, the wiring on it's 50 years old. It's time to uh, it's time for an update. Simplify this nonsense that's going on in here. Um, get rid of a lot of the hoses. I want it nice and clean in there. Um, and then fix everything that's wrong with it. Um, there's some ignition problems, so I want to put a new uh, set of points and condenser on it. Um, I got some replacement coils I'm going to put onto it. I'm looking at it. Look at the camera. I am looking at it. So 
Uh, we've been having a little bit of ignition breakdown when we were riding it last, so I want to put a new set of points. I'm pointing on this side, but of course they're on the other side of the engine. I want to put a new uh, set of points in it, a new condenser. I got some replacement coils already, new spark plugs, of course, and um, new wheel bearings. Um, new, I don't know if it has bearings or bushings in the swing arm. We'll address that, make sure that's all up to date. I want to do something different with the exhaust, maybe a two into one exhaust on the other side, I think would look nice. Um, get rid of the luggage rack. Not sure about the back fender. I kind of like the back fender. We'll leave that. Unfortunately, we're going to lose our Brazilian flag sticker when we replace the um, rear shocks. Um, chain guard, it's got to go. The only thing a chain guard does is hide the chain and then you don't do enough chain maintenance. I'd rather get that out of there. Uh, this cover, just like I said on the other side, is going to go away. There's some um, electronics, if you can call them that, underneath here. Um, it's got a rectifier for the charging system, a starter solenoid, and a coil. Um, all of this I'm hoping to be able to relocate inside of the frame. I'll know more once um, I replace the coils. Um, this is pretty small. There's quite a bit of room in there. I'm sure we can move enough stuff around. And again, nice and flat on this side, maybe a number plate over it. So we got our work cut out for us. There's a whole long list we're going to be doing. Um, it's going to go throughout the winter, a number of videos. Um, and we're going to bring you along for the ride. Hopefully by the summer, we'll be ready to put it on the road again, get some nice, uh, nice rides in on it. Yeah. So come along with us for the ride. We're going to be working on it all winter long. Um, hopefully a lot of nice videos, maybe some tips. And not exactly a lot of people are riding these bikes anymore, but I hope you'll enjoy what we put out. Thanks for watching. open to all of you watching us opinions and help and tips and suggestions because as we know the internet is full of opinions and, and, and we do want to hear you know i don't know everything about motorcycles in fact i probably know very little as compared to a lot of people out there but we do the best we can this is Moto. i'm bear i'm gabby thanks for watching thanks for watching give us a follow if you like yeah yeah you can subscribe you know, that's a thing now. People are doing that nowadays. We're also on Instagram. Yeah. They say it's all, all the kids all are doing. All the kids are doing the Instagrams nowadays. You should give us a follow.